Hi, you guys. My name is Giles. I've done box for over 10 years. I've read articles and had plenty of experience in the basic box combinations and some uh, footwork. I'm going to go ahead and read three combinations. Combination 1, Combination 2, Combination 3. So combination 1 is going to be jab, jab, straight. So what I like everybody to do is get in a boxing stance. And from there, just go ahead and throw two jabs. And then add straight. And go ahead and practice. And I'm going to come around. Make sure everybody do it correctly and I'm also going to demonstrate. So go ahead and begin. Jab, jab, straight. Jab, jab, straight. Take a step a little bit. Jab, jab, straight. Jab, jab, straight. You can also come back. And notice on the pivot, for the pivot, I'm doing the jab, jab, straight, and I'm pivoting on that back foot for the last punch. You can go ahead and step in with the jabs. Jab, jab, straight. Now for combination two, box stance, jab, straight, and add your left hook. I'm going to do it again. One, two, three. Now go ahead and practice. And while you guys practice, I'm going to go around and make sure everybody did it correctly. And also I'm going to demonstrate it as well. Jab, straight, hook. Jab, straight, hook. If you notice, play the hands. As I throw the jab, the straight, and then the hook, it all comes back to my face. One, two, three. Jab, straight, hook. You can go ahead and move around, back, forth. You can practice it when you're ready. Make sure you guys give me a good pivot. A good pivot. Now, for combination three, it's going to be. Jab, straight, and two hooks. One, two, three, four. Go ahead and practice it. I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate and come around and show you guys do it correctly. One, two, three, four. Jab, straight, two hooks. Same thing as before. Notice when I throw my jab, straight, two hooks, how it all comes back to the face. Give me some good pivots on the last three punches. Pivot, pivot, and pivot. It should be like this. Jab, pivot, pivot, pivot. Step in, pivot, pivot, pivot. Make sure punches come back to the face. One, two, three. Three, four. Now I'm going to go ahead and do some floor exercises. What I want everybody to do is grab their imaginary jump rope and start jump roping like this. Go ahead and begin. I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate make sure everybody's doing it correctly. Now, if you guys want, you guys can actually run in place too as well while moving your hands. Go ahead and move backwards, forwards. You can go ahead and do sides, kind of like jumping jacks. You don't have to do the same jump movement, it could be different. You can move forward. And from there, go ahead and relax. The next exercise I'm going to go ahead and lead is going to be jumping jacks. You can go ahead and do your start just from here. And then just go ahead and separate your legs. And come right back into it. Go ahead and begin. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, demonstrate and also do it with you guys too as well. So, that'll be one, two, three, four, five. Just like the last exercise, you can go ahead and move around too as well if you want. Forward, sometimes a little bit harder. And you can go ahead and move backwards, sometimes it could be a little bit harder. Alright, for the last exercise right here, is I'm going to want to separate your legs, shoulder width apart, squat down, squat back up, 
squat down and give me a little bit of a jump, a little bit of space between the ground and floor. I'm going to go ahead and show you one more time. Squat, jump. Go ahead and begin. I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate and go around the room to make sure everybody's doing it correctly. Go ahead and exhale and lift off. Just like before, if you want to move around, that's okay as well. Go ahead and do like five more. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. If you guys want to shake it out, loosen up a little bit, that's fine as well. All right, my name is jo has been Josh Godwin. It's been a good way to work out with you guys. Thank you for letting me uh, do this interview.